make sure your uh, all your marking out is done but make sure this line here is reversed onto the other side like that this will make it easier bending that line later so placing the bender line up your line with this edge here okay and then clamp up then we need to wind in the support plate so it supports the work here then once that's nice and snug bend that to 90 degrees and remove from the bender wind out the support plate to allow you to place the bend in the opposite way around now to bend the second 90 degree bend again lining up with the edge of the bender and bend round to 90 Okay, now we're going to attempt to do the 45 degree bend. There's a 45 degree square that you can use to gauge the bend. Again, we line up in the bender at this point here, just like before. Tighten up again, wind up the support plate until it's snug behind the work and then we can bend to 45 using this gauge help us okay and the final bend making sure that the work is placed into the vise this way we then line up the line with the top of the vise yeah and get ready to bend using a cloth on the top when using a hammer just uh, prevents it hurting your hand as you're hitting the piece across and what we're trying to do is we're trying to get this section here parallel with this section down here And once we're done, it should look something like that.